Hey, good day everyone and welcome to my channel where we make structural engineering design simple and easy. My name is Olodu Kunyedi and I'm your host. I want to say very, very big thank you to everyone who has subscribed to this channel. I really, really appreciate that. I really appreciate everyone that has taken their time to subscribe to uh, China. That's the only way you can show that you appreciate the value we are delivering from every videos that we've uploaded. And also those that have been sending some wonderful message, some very encouraging message. I want to say big thank you to Putas Sok Putarasa from Thailand. I've been seeing all your encouraging messages. I appreciate you. Putasok Putarasa from Thailand. I appreciate I appreciate it. Ajay Odu Odunayo Odunayo. I appreciate you, but you didn't tell us where you are chatting us from, where you are commenting from. Please, when you are commenting, please tell us where you are commenting from. You said very helpful. Thank you. We appreciate you, Ajay. Banta Obona from Rivers. You said, I can't download the file. Please go to the description. Um, the description. Uh, um, status or the description bar where I I made a description of the video click on there's a Google Sheets click on it it was if you can't download it will send me a message to allow you share the to to share the video and I will grant you access to the video so just click on the link and follow the the Follow the instruction, it will send maybe restriction to assess it. So, but once you say you click on it, it will send me an email which I will approve uh, so you can assess the Google link. I really appreciate that. Banta Obona from Rivers, Asan Ilaya. Hassan Elia, you said thank you for this video, but you did not upload your AutoCAD template. I did upload my AutoCAD template. Anytime I mention that I will be uploading my templates, check the description and the description status. That is a place, the description. If you check there, you see the Google link. Click on it. If you don't have access, it will send me a mail and I will grant you access so you can assess the template, the AutoCAD template. Is there, please? Check that. And Asan, Alai, you didn't tell us where you are commenting from. Please um, tell us where you are commenting from next time. If you are in Nigeria, tell us the state. And if you are outside Nigeria, please tell us the country you are commenting from it is very helpful to us also we have man hamat abaka man hamat abaka you didn't tell us where you are commenting from too please next time if you are commenting please just tell us the state if you're in nigeria or if you're outside nigeria please tell us the country you are commenting from you said, please, how can I increase the height of a column in Prota structure? How can you increase the height of your column? Prota structure comes in a default height of 3000 mm. A default, a default height of 3000 mm. If you create this is an AutoCAD uh, proto structure um, model. 
automatically if you click on insert stories it automatically by default insert story every three meters which is three thousand mm so but if you want to change that let's assume your ground floor to your first floor is is um let's say four meter then first floor to roof is 3.5 meter what do you do ha uh, mahamat abaka please listen carefully if you want to increase the height of your column if you want to increase the height of your column this is what you do come to building setters after you've you've insert your story and you've done everything and you want to increase the height you see come to this part come to this part hit edit story if you click on the edit story this are the height of the columns these are the height so let's assume floor one means from ground to first floor y2 is from first floor story one is your first floor from ground to first floor y story two is from your first floor to your roof let's assume this is four and this is 3.5 if you look carefully the levels they've changed automatically they've changed automatically so this is how you can change so depending if you have depending on the floors if you have up to five floors and the the floor heights are different this is how you change it let's assume this is if you say four four point five it changes automatically so this is how you change your your height your height i hope this answers your question and if you still have any other question please click just um, subscribe and you can make your your comments or your questions and we will be glad to do a video explaining it in detail and if you are yet to subscribe to our channel please hit the subscribe button share you can share the video you can like our video and when you click the subscribe button we you will be notified whenever we come up with any of this drawing i hope this video was helpful to you and if you still have any question please send it via the comment section when you are commenting please tell us where you are commenting from and also if you've not subscribed please hit the subscribe button then also if you are done with this you click ok it will tell you if you've done the analysis before you can say yes and voila that's it then if you come to um, 3d 3d aspect now if you look carefully it has changed the height and everything we would have been changed so this is how you can change your height and you will have the problem so thank you very very much so until we put up another video i'll say remain blessed and thank you